F A 18 Super Hornet Accident explained, there are many ways to lose an aircraft in war. Anti-aircraft missiles, enemy fighter jets, human error caused by fatigue, and strained airframe from the high operational tempo can all result in a lost aircraft. But during peace, most aircraft are lost due to mechanical failure or human error. It is seldom the case that a fighter jet with a price tag of more than $50 million rolls overboard from an aircraft carrier. And yet it seems that this is what happened when the US Navy lost an F-A-18 Super Hornet late last week. What we know, aircraft overboard, on July 8, an F-A-18 Super Hornet assigned to Carrier Air Wing 1 and embarked abroad the USS Harry S. Truman aircraft carrier was blown overboard due to heavy seas caused by a storm in the Mediterranean Sea. When the accident happened, the USS Truman was conducting a replenishment at sea operation, usually helicopters ferrying supplies to the aircraft carrier, smaller warships replenished by sailing next to the replenishment ship. And the F-A-18 Super Hornet must not have been secured down adequately. One sailor received minor injuries while conducting operations during the unexpected heavy weather. The sailor is in stable condition and expected to make a full recovery, the Navy said in a press release, adding that all personnel aboard the ship are accounted for. USS Harry S. Truman and embarked aircraft remain full mission capable. Details and the cause of the incident are under investigation, the Navy added in its short press release. This is the third, and the second in the Mediterranean Sea, aircraft carrier incident involving fighter jets in the last few months. Mm. 